like to perhaps be with you? Uh, good evening, everybody. Um, my name again is Scott Barry. I work with Muhammad at uh, BPNE. We had to address some, uh, some concerns, which by then I read in the uh, report here that are getting less and less frequent every meeting that we come to. I guess that's the cause of the time. Now, first off, I say not only is Regina the best teacher in the North End, is the best teacher in the state. Thank you very much. We get a lot of fun talking on Route 1. Thank you. Um, so we're here to address uh, any continued concerns or questions that are ongoing, and I guess I'll start off on a, on a more positive note. Uh, at the end of this month, uh, everybody knows about the, uh, the concerts at the Boston Garden for the Boston One Fund. Uh, BPNE we decided to, to donate all the proceeds and profits uh, of that night to the uh, Boston One Fund. I just thought I'd maybe make note of that. So, yes, we are. So, any questions or concerns? We'll, we'll be happy to address tonight. Uh, I'd like Victor, first of all, to give us more of an explanation on what we're uh, uh, voting on. <laughs> <laughs> there was a little confusion and uncertainty um, last month, which was why uh, this was uh, no vote was taken and this was, uh, was brought forward to this month, and I had promised to talk to Dan and so it was across the traffic department for uh, enlightenment, and I did. And what he said was that this came up for two reasons. One, because the city data uh, system has improved and continues to improve over the years. And it came up at ISD that the, uh, the zoning aspect of this, which is what is before us, because it's going to be the field, the, Parking is a conditional use, and the Board of Appeal puts conditions, time conditions, on their zoning approval. It could be one year, two years, up to five years, he said, as usual. So why, has, why do other uh, parking, uh, uh, parking lots not come before us? Because the data system wasn't as sophisticated as it is now, so perhaps we will be seeing more. But anyway, that's why we're here, but that's why they're here. They're here for zoning relief. Zoning relief is the conditional use, and it's for a period of time up to the board what the period is. The Boston Traffic Department and Dan Nuzzo do the annual renewals, and he said that that's like the licensing board. Uh, they file their application, file their fee, whatever it is, for the annual renewal, and he will renew unless there are problems that come to him, unless he's made aware of problems by the neighborhood. And if if he is, then he will deal with them, but until now, I can see this not uh, heard of problem. So that's why we're here, and that's what we're going on. So, so, so it's safe to say we're kind of a guinea pig because of the technology. Apparently. Right? Okay, yes. that's okay. Thank we got broad shoulders. We, we appreciate that. Okay, questions? Uh, I wonder, Victor, did you make him aware of the problem, but he, now he knows? Yes, yes, yes. As a matter of fact, he and I walked down to the lot, and saw some uh, some cars parked hanging over onto the uh, Endicott Street sidewalk, which he noticed and I didn't because it was so small, but he said they are encroaching and they shouldn't be. Okay, other questions? Um, just remind me again of ISD. ISD is uh, uh, Inspectional Services Department of the city. Okay, uh, any comments uh, for or against David? Uh, my comment is first that I want to repeat what I said last month, that I believe that that lot, regardless of how well it's operated, it just adds to the dangerousness of that intersection, and especially for pedestrians. Any violation of the permit greatly adds to the dangerousness of, the, uh, of that intersection. And there have been some violations that I've observed since our last meeting. Yes, the violations are less frequent, a lot less frequent than they once were, but they still happen from time to time. I, uh, you know, I wouldn't be opposed to, uh, or let me put it a different way. I would go along with the newer members opposing this, 
On the other hand, I would also go along with a fairly tight time frame for the extension of use, meaning one year instead of three or five. And that would give us a year to see whether or not they're going to continue to um, live by the conditions of the permit. You said they would have to be delivered yet, though not necessarily publicly. Well, my understanding is that the Board of Appeal puts a time limit on their uh, conditional use. And Dave is suggesting, I guess, that we should ask them to put a, a, a minimal time limit. We, we may be able to get conditions put into the permit, but I'm sure the permit already doesn't allow the kinds of violations that we've seen that we've seen at that site. And also the permit renewal itself does not come before the neighborhood. I've never seen a permit renewal by itself uh, come for come before the community for review. But the Board of Appeal zoning decision will come to the community again. And why not in a year to judge whether they're managing the property properly? Did they take heed on that? We would have that. <laughs> it's hard to know what the board would deal with. But we could, but we could certainly uh, make a motion uh, with that in the motion. Hmm. OK. Yeah, and vote on that. Sure. OK. Would you like to make that motion, David? Uh, if there aren't any other questions any other or comments. Questions? Yeah, I move that we vote to support this application. Uh, with the contingency that the Board of Appeals conditional use provide for no more than a one year extension of the parking lot use. Second. Okay, seconded. Uh, okay. Um, we will use ballot number two, which is green, and uh, we support this proposal for the support. Can you explain what an opposed? If we it, what that would mean? Well, we would recommend to the vice chair that they not. Okay. 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 For our license to only be a year and then comes up for another vote. Is that correct? Additional right? use right. approval will be for one for year. year. Yep. Right. So what we're going to have there is Dave's motion. Right. Yeah. Now, so it's not a proposal. Yeah. Okay. So if you support the proposal of approval with one year renewal yeah. and support our opposed act, we will vote again if we know. And the motion passes 27 in support and one vote.